Hey there guys and welcome to a special episode of Final Fantasy X HD Remastered. In this episode we're going to be talking to the lovely Belgamine. And we haven't seen her since the moon flow, so let's see what she has to say. And she also should know our um, current status. So let's go see. Oh, you again. You're quite the notorious traitor these days. Oh. What's it to you? <laughs> <laughs> oh, you shouldn't take what the Maester say too seriously. For summoners, destroying sin is everything. We are no tools of Yevon. Understand? Yes. Right. So, are you up to the task? I do not know, but I will do my best. You've got spirit, but you'll need more to beat sin. An Aeon duel. Show me what you're made of. Sure, the, sure we haven't really fought you since the moon flows. At least he... How strong you got too, so it's fight. Excellent. But before we begin, I've just healed your aeons for you. Let us begin. Now this one's a little different. We haven't seen her since she summoned Ixion. So she's going to summon good old Shiva. Choose your Aeon well, Summoner. And you guys know where we're going we're gonna to summon. Although this battle, battle's not going to be as easy as you think it is. You'll see in a minute. Coming out, Bahamut. Not Bahamut. Bahamut. Sorry. Alright. So. So common sense would say, oh wait, she weakness fire. Let's just use fire go. Well, there's a little problem with that. You'll see in a second. See? It did that less damage. Such attributes on the Aeon uh, such attributes and the Aeon menu to raise the attributes of your Aeons. The use is to, to compensate for Aeon's weaknesses by raising the physical the phys uh, physically weak Shiva's HP or raising the usual slow if it's agility. But yeah, we're going to be introduced to another tutorial about raising our Aeons and stats. So that's why Shiva, even though she was weak as fire, she's not going to be that helpful. So let's just use something else like inputs. Yeah, see? It's not going to be as easy as you think it is. Uh oh. Ouch. Ah, oh, you missed. No more attack. Why bam? Our best shot is probably just, probably just to use Bruce and just use that Omega what Omega flare on him. Ouch. Man, I thought our best place to use Bruce and I should have attacked. Whatever. Uh -huh. Yeah, yeah, hey, um, boost will still, it will still work even if the attack missed. I'm gonna get lucky with these evasions. Uh oh. Ouch, hurts. Actually, this is an impulse. No, no more attack. Ooh, critical. So, Alright, let's try to see if we can finish her off with a Mega Flare. Go. This should go past the break damage limit. Or rather, get past the damage limit. Did it? Is it it? Good. Good job. Good job, Bahamut. Good job. So, yeah, see, it's not going to be as easy as you thought it was. Good job, Muhammad. You did well. My mighty Aeon. Who's also the King of Dragons, so that's to be expected. <sighs> Impressive. Remarkable talent. Traitor or no, Thank you. you may have what it takes to beat Zin. Take this. You have earned it. And we get this. Oh, well, oh, we get 30 power spheres. Cool. And with the Aeon Thank soul, you. not the Summer Soul. I we think get the you last do just fine. 
But if you ever feel like you want more training, seek the hidden temple of Remium. I will be waiting there. Remium. Farewell. I remember that place name for later, folks. Possessing the Aeon Soul allows you to raise the Aeon stats. Select attributes and select the Aeon. We we'll use Ixen as an example. The selected Aeon stats with display stats that cannot be raised are shown in gray. The Aeon's current stats are shown on the right. For example, Ixen's strength is 20. When you use a set to raise, the item cost of, of the of the, 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 for the procedure is dis displayed on the right of the screen. Item cost will increase according to the Aeon's current stat values. Oh, in, the, uh, in other words, the higher the stat value, the higher the item cost will be raised. You know, that's, it's, it's basically like the Aeon Soul, just except for spells, you'll be raising your stats. And I think they're going to always use the spheres. Okay. <coughs> anyway, guys, we will end it there because I want to do it as a bonus episode since I did the last two and about like that. But now we're going to end right here. But next time on Let's Play Final Fantasy 10, we're going to be continuing on with the plot of the story and heading to Mount Gagazet. So I'll tell you guys, see you guys next time.